My name is Pavilon, sir. Cavan. Is that the kid's name? Cavan? Where did he run off to? Sir, it would be my privilege to work with you. Pardon me, sir? I don't have to <laughs> I don't have time to play games, Cavan. I hate I'm like the the word Cavan is hard to say. I have a lot of work to do. I feel like she got well, I guess they were he's sitting down. I felt like let's say she got tall. Yes, sir. I've managed transport of hundreds of units of inventory per day. Pardon me, sir? Cavan. <laughs> there you are. What are you wearing? Where's your shirt? That's a cape. Take that off. Let's get you dressed. No, I like it. That job was in India, sir, but... <laughs> Kevin, wait there. Don't run. Oh, my man's out. With the quickness. <laughs> Kevin, come back here. This has become a routine now. Bad. There's something distracting me and it's bothering me just as much as it is you. Yes, sir. Bachelor of the of Science in Physics, sir. Ayo, that towel. <laughs> that towel is so dirty, da. Here, wear this shirt, Kana. No. So instead of Kevin or Kevin, it's Kana. But sir, you can't. Or you can just take me on a probation period, maybe. I'm driven, self-started, and a quick learner, sir. Put this on, Kana. Hurry up now. But I don't want to. Speak in Tamil, Kevin. I can't understand what you're saying. You don't have to pay until then. Please, Kana. I understand, sir. Oh my, this is hectic. Uh, yes, good boy. Okay. Thank you, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you for considering me. Good day. Well, we haven't even started cooking. And I got something to check on my teeth. That's what's bothering me right now. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hello, Mr. Bachelor of Science. What happened? Same old. They didn't buy the hundreds of units of inventory, sorry. I'm telling you, it's time to go for it. Or it's time for it to go. Wait, what? I'm telling you, it's time for it to go. Maybe this one? Let's be a, let's be a little asshole about it. That's not entirely untrue. I helped out in grocery stores when I was 12. And you were paid in candy. <laughs> Ah, well, I've only worked as a writer back home. I don't see myself getting a job for that here. Not for my English. No, not with my English. I spend half these calls asking them to repeat themselves. I should watch cartoons with Kevin. If I can't understand those, if I can understand those shows, maybe I can understand these people too. Yay! <laughs> we watch Batman together. Yes, but your son is going to forget Tamal at this rate. Did you know his friends call him Kevin? Oh, God. <laughs> what's wrong with that? Speaking to Melda. Well, what's wrong with that? Wait. <laughs> it's only one letter that's different anyways. That's, that's why we picked it. Names tell stories. Uh, maybe this one. I like this one. It's a way for people to learn about you and where you're from. You shouldn't be afraid to correct your friends. It's your name, after all. Who, who else is going to tell them? And Kevin means beautiful. It's such a lovely name. It suits you well. I don't want to be beautiful. <laughs> I want to be Kev. I just want to be Kevin. He's brighter than us, Vemba. He's learned to adapt. We haven't. 
You know, he aced yesterday's English quiz. Okay. My man's did it. He did. Really? Good job. We should celebrate. What do you want to eat? I'll make something special. Ooh. Can we order pizza, my man? Oh, she said, can I make... Oh, she wanted to make something special. And my man hit her with the... Can we get pizza? <laughs> <laughs> Can we get a picture? Speak. Bro. It's like weird because they want him to speak in Tamil. Tamil. And I don't know if like the game is doing it or not. I want pizza. Like is he doing that in Tamil? Like. Is this supposed to be in another language and they're just translating it for me so I feel good about myself? <laughs> like or like is Tamil just English? I'm kidding on that one. Like, shut the fuck up. <laughs> but, like, seriously. I don't get that part. How about something better? How about we make something at home? You know, I can say... How about something better is what I can see. A like, porrota. Okay. Dosa. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, gi dosa. Birrani. Carradosa. <laughs> no, I'm tired of all of these. See, that's the issue. You gotta you guys are saying cool shit, but it, like he's probably you know, he wants the cool 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 shit. He wants fucking he wants to go up to the mountains and you know, eat some wildlife. Cause he's had the other stuff a million times, you know? He's also had pizza a million times, so let's be real. Why does he want pizza? Extra cheese. Oh, my God. Dude's going to be freaking lactose intolerant by the time he's 18. Extra toppings. You eat pizza all the time. Literally, like, he just contradicted himself. He eats other things all the time, but so does he. Calvin. Have you ever had put? Am, am I? <laughs> Have you ever? <laughs> no. What's that? Yeah, please enlighten me. I've only seen my mother make it before. It's a lot of fun to make. Reminds me of a rocket. Rocket? Yes. A lot of steam comes out when you make it. <laughs> It looks like a rocket <laughs> launching. It does? Putu. Putu. Put. Okay. I'm <laughs> oh my goodness. Yes. But you know what? Let's just order pizza. There's no rocket, but you get a nice cardboard box that you can make your imaginations come through with. Oh, he's got to think. She's got him. She's got him hooked. Will it really look like a rocket launch? Oh, she's got him hooked. I'm interested in this now. What kind of food we eat and that looks like a freaking rocket launch? You want to see? Because I'm down. Yeah, because I got to make it. All right, let's get started. I haven't made this before, but Ama has has a recipe on it. Hopefully, it's readable. Where's the rocket? We need to make the flower first, style. Uh. Hey, pump up the music, baby. Well, let's try to get this first time, you know? I was being a little goofy the, sec this, the first time around, but I think we got this one first try. First try, just like that. Ingredi ingredients we got the 50 grams of rice water blend the rice then we need to separate the fine rice from chunks blank chunks combine 50 grams of fine rice with water blend the chunks probably is what I'm assuming and repeat step one you know Kind of what I'm thinking. Alright. 
So we gotta blend the rice. Then we need to separate that shit. And the water goes in last. So take the top off. Oh, I didn't read. My bad. Uh, when do we get the rocket part? Soon, dog. Uh, be patient. Yeah, you're gonna have to be real patient with me. There we go. Blend that, baby. Can I put this somewhere? Can we put this in here? I should shake the cervezas over the towel. Okay. Did I say cervezas? Because I don't know if I meant to say that. Look at that. We're fucking bros. Look at that. What did I say? You just repeat step one. And then we're back, baby. Shake, 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 shake. Shake, 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 shake. We're cooking with gas. Put that back in there. Got a little bit left. Oof. Put that back in there. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Shake that ass, baby. Shake, shake, shake. <laughs> Make that flower, baby. Ah, ah, ah. There we go. And we're out. And then put... I need to read. And combined. Okay. So, there we go. I think this is perfect. Why does this feel... Why does this feel flower... Why does this feel like flower... I was missing that word. I need to take a sip of... Uh, Water. Um, why does it feel like flour even though there's there is so much water? We have to mix the flour and water a little bit. The final consistency should feel like slightly wet sand. Okay. Alright, that wasn't too hard. I'm so glad we're teaching fucking Pavilon over here. Ama. When will we get to the rocket? Oh, this guy's so impatient. Oh, new recipe. Oh my goodness. We're freaking... We're losing here. So, you know me. I'm not... I can't math. I can't read. I can't do a lot of things. This is not the game for me. But, alright. This is straightforward. Assemble the parts so that the water steam and and cooks the water steam and cooks the what's above. Okay. Tricky part is figuring out how much rice and coconut is needed. And in what order coconut can crumble easily. Oh, this is wild. They got me I'm being a real chef right now. Okay. Uh. So the water goes in here. That's fucking step one if I've ever seen. That's perfect. And then put that bad boy on top of that, right? Oh, I gotta fill this thing first, actually, probably. It's uh, three tablespoons of, you guessed it, who knows what the fuck. Then you have your four tablespoons of, oh, and you have to put it in a certain order. Okay. Okay. And so we just have to guess with the coconut and guess with the flour. Everything else is straightforward. So we either have four tablespoons. So what is it looking like? It's, um, it'll be one, two, one, two, one, 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 one. Two, one, two, one. That's it, baby. Oh fucking god! Put the cap on. Get her. Get her. Am I missing something? Maybe cap off. Is there one more? One, two, one, two, one. What is? Yeah, that's it. 
next. Put coconut layers as far away. From, okay, yeah. Wait, oh, okay, so the coconut layers need to be the one. Alright, I get it, I get it. Let me top off, top off. Um, dump? Can I dump this? <laughs> okay. Step one. Um, coconut, then flour. Coconut, then flour. You know, this is what happens when you read. Oops. And that's it. Then we can put this on. Put this on. Beautiful. Genius. Hook her up. And it's a rocket. It's launch time, Kaban. Yeah, we made sushi. Upright sushi. The vertical sushi. That was so cool. Remember, I can't believe it didn't fall. Ama. Can we do that again? That probably tastes so good. I'm not a fan of coconut, but like you probably, you know, dip that in something. And I can see it being good. Ah, uh, we were unable to what? I didn't read that. I was too busy in my dialogue. Is he asleep? I think so. Gabon? Why do we need, what? What are we doing right now? Yes, he is. No, he's not. Good. So that interview. Why can't we, can't we both go to the bathroom? Have this conversation real quick. While the dude's just by himself in the bed. Another dead end? Yes. I think I knew that before I took the call. <laughs> no relevant Canadian work experience. We'll keep, uh, we'll keep you on the file. I don't know. I feel like I diluted, bro. This dude needs to work at Amazon with me. I, <laughs> I'm just kidding. I feel like I diluted us into thinking we can make it work here well don't worry i'll go to the employment office again tomorrow what i know you don't like surish but i think you should take that sales job at his company it's all about who it's all about who you know here it really we really are at no we're not we really are at the end of our ropes nah and we barely know anyone we're not in the position to pick and choose our help i thought moving here would be a chance to start over i mean haven't you been trying motherfucker oh my god not even here we're st <laughs> we still have to beg people like Surish. it's not begging I know. I'll call him tomorrow. But honestly, I think you're more qualified for sales than I am. I mean, the way you sold Kevin on um, the Putu, Putu today. You're really good with kids. I can't believe you're having a hard time teaching in school. Well, it's not like teaching back home. It makes me worry about Kevin. Why? Yeah, well, what's going on? Why? Why is that? Well, back home, I could get to, I could get the class to laugh, open up, get them in the mood to learn, you know. But it's harder here. What is? What does that have to do with Kevin? I just feel that there's a wall between me and my class. I can't connect with them. They, le they lead very different lives than we do. And I feel the same wall growing around Kevin. How do you mean? Ah, uh, I see. What if I can't connect with Kevin? It's like, he, he's just, you know... He's living the Canadian dream. 
um i mean it's not hard to talk to him because you literally you you did talk to him just fine you convinced him i guess you can yeah the other day he told me he wished he had his own room like his friends he said he needs his privacy what five-year-old needs privacy <laughs> Can you even imagine asking for something like that when we were a kid? It's like he's in a different world than us. See, dude's about to wake up. Can we have this conversation in the bathroom? Clearly we're in a studio apartment. Can we please take this conversation elsewhere? <laughs> Someone go out for a fake smoke, like something. Well, it's more than just that. He doesn't eat lunch at school. He's not interested in anything we do. That's every kid. Let's do the lunch. Because every kid fucking hates everything. Every parent does. He doesn't eat. Um, he brings it back every day with some excuse. I don't know if the other kids make fun of him for it. Or if he's embarrassed. I don't know. I'm worried. These things bother me too. I mean, brother, you didn't even want to eat the Idlis. <sighs> worried about what? I'm worried about you, Pavilon. He couldn't even eat the Idlis. He couldn't even make the Idlis. And he's over here talking about he's worried about this kid not. Like, this kid's never going to learn how to make Idlis because you don't know how to make Idlis. And you've been married for how long now? I'm confused. But we choose to bring him. <laughs> my bad. That's my little rant. <laughs> but we choose to bring him up here, not him. We did it because we thought he'd have a better life here. And he does. This place comes with better educa education and opportunity. But it also comes with its own culture, language, and values. We can't pick and choose the ones we want and ask him to ignore from the others. I think it's natural that any kid wants to fit in, right? Facts. Yes, maybe. It's just scary. Don't worry, Venba. He'll turn out just fine. How are you so sure? He's our child. Hey, he clapped back with the same thing. <laughs> it's funny because he's going to, he acts like this right now, the kid, but like he's going to be, when he gets a little bit older, he's going to be wishing. That he's like, yo, mom, that putu, that puta, that, that putu, um, <laughs> that putu that we made with a fucking rocket, teach me how to make that shit right now. <laughs> like, he's gonna, he's gonna be wanting to indulge in the culture. How else will he turn out? You know? You just gotta give him time. 